Hello guys, it's Chaucer here, and today I'm mad about YouTube. Now, before we get angry, sorry I didn't put up a video yesterday. I remembered uh, that I actually didn't put up my Dark Pit unboxing uh, about 5 in the morning. You know, I'm about to go to bed, so I'm like, well, not about to go to bed, I was about to go upstairs, so I'm like, eh, crap, um, whatever. Anyways, let's just get on with this video. And, uh, Odie, you have to hit the tripod every time. I'm like, really? Really? Anyways. So, it, it, it's overpopulated. Now, what I mean by this is, so if you're a smaller YouTuber, and you don't have any friends that are popular YouTubers, yeah, you're not going anywhere. Like, there's a, it's really unlikely you're going anywhere at this point, because there's so many people who do YouTube, and, like, there's just not any more room. So, unless if you have a friend or you can record with someone that's popular, you have no chance. Sorry, but I, I don't have a chance. Like, I mean, I'm not trying to sound like, you know, rude, but I mean, if anyone should be getting more popularity, it should be someone like me because, now here's the reason. I've been on here since 2009. I, it's not like I'm new to this crap. I was here way, way back in the day. Like, you know all your popular YouTubers you watch? Yep. Uh, I kinda was here before most of them. Like, um, for example, um, PewDiePie. I was here before he was. I'm pretty sure, at least. Unless if I'm missing something, but I'm about 99.9% .9 sure that I was here before he was, which, yeah. So, like I said, it's just so overpopulated. Smaller YouTubers have literally, like, almost zero chance. It's it's terrible. And there's nothing we can do about it. <laughs> Unless we record a popular YouTubers. Like, nothing, nothing we can do. Which is terrible, because, yeah, you know, it's just... God dang it, why? Um, anyways. Uh, next thing. Is Google+. Plus. Okay, um... Now, yeah, alright, they're disconnecting Google+, Plus, which took them almost two years to figure out. But here's the thing, the damage is already done. The damage is already done. Because here's what they did. They decided, well, we have this new service, or not, I don't know if it was new or not, but Google+, Plus. how about, how about, because it's not doing well, all YouTube users are going to have to make a Google+, Plus account to keep going. It's not how you make a service popular, that's how you make it hated. That's why they had millions and millions of users on their site, is because all YouTubers had to, okay? Every single YouTuber had to freaking make a Google Plus account to keep going. That's really stupid. It took them two, almost two years to figure out that, oh, well, maybe shoving another service down all these guys' throats isn't the best of ideas. And it's not. It's a terrible one. You don't do that, like, I think they're like, well, maybe they'll end up liking our service. No, I hate it to this day. And, see, here's the thing. They should have made it an option. This is something we'll get into more as a video, as this video progresses. Options. Anyways, but yeah, they should have made it, like, an option to, you know, kind of, um, have Google Plus. Like, you know, like, you can link up with your, like, Twitter and stuff, with your YouTube. They should have did that. Like, okay, yeah, you can link it with your Google Plus, but you don't have to. It's not. It's not mandatory. That you don't have to. Nope. So when I when you can uh, disconnect it, I'm disconnecting. Unless if it does something bad, which in that case that sucks. But yeah, it's it's just something no one really wants to deal with. All right. So next thing. Next thing is. I miss the old YouTube. Now, okay, you could argue, well, you're just a veteran complaining about, you know, YouTube and, you know, nostalgia factor. Well, kind of, yes. And there are two big things about the old YouTube we'll get into. Those are my top two reasons, but ratings and, um, groups. Those are just a couple things I want to cover. So, ratings. You know, how now it's okay, you know, I like it or I dislike it used to be, well, rate uh, out of five stars. One star. Yeah, I don't like it, you know. 
to five stars. Yeah, I really liked it. It was just and there's like point like five point five for example. You do or not five point five like four point five. You do. It was a cleaner, better rating system. Like it worked better. So when you see a video instead of saying like saying okay this is the like bar this is the dislike bar, no it used to just be. Well okay. This video, like instead of saying, "Oh, I have a thousand likes," opposed to a hundred and a hundred dislikes on this video, you see, well, my video is it's rated four stars. See, I I, I liked that better. So, anyways, um, and then groups. Now, Google Plus has the circles, but it's not the same. Groups basically, here's what you could do. So you could make a group. So you were like the, you know, the gold star. I remember all of this pretty clearly. So you had the gold star. Okay. And then the leader could promote people to, uh, like, kind of like a moderator. They got silver stars. And then the moderators, you know, had more access. Like, you could pick what different members could do. And, like, then there's the regular members who were just, they just basically joined through. All you have to do is hit a button, you join the group, boom. So basically, like, let's just say um, you could upload videos to that group. Now, like, it'd be on your channel and stuff, but then, like, you could just have... It's kind of like a giant playlist with multiple people. It's pretty cool. Oh, uh, well, it was pretty cool. Um, so, let's, let's just say the leader is the only one who can respond... No, no. The leader is the only one who can delete the group, basically. He's, the only, he's, like, in charge of all the options. So, he has access to all the options. He's the only one who can. Now, then, there's the premium members who can basically do anything besides the options, okay? And, um, then there's the regular members who maybe they can't, like, post anything. Like, not post, but, like, they can't post, like, uh, comments or anything on the page, for example. Um, I don't know if that's really how it worked, but I can't quite remember everything, but it was, I know it was pretty cool. Next thing is the YouTube layouts. Okay, here, here's why I'm going to get angry. So, if you guys remember, way back, way, way back, the YouTube layouts used to be simple and cool. Well, now they suck. <laughs> Best put, they're terrible. No one likes the YouTube layout. Everyone complains about it. Like, eventually, I think we're just going to get to a white screen. You tell that everything's getting whiter and whiter. That's it. And eventually we're going to have a big white screen with black text. Or blue text. Whatever. Depending. So it's just going to be a white screen with text. That's all it's going to be at some point. Okay, so 2010 was the last good YouTube layout. In my opinion. 2009, 10, when I was there, that's when the things were good. Now 2011 kind of got meh. It wasn't terrible, but wasn't the best thing either so yeah um, so yeah um, 2012 is where everything turned terrible and then 13 14 15 just followed terrible so hopefully when we get the 2016 layout it's more of the old layouts that were actually good so oh god damn I hate these layouts they're so bad alright now we're gonna get the thing that makes me the most angry with YouTube Okay, so, you know, layouts, okay, sites change their layouts, I guess we'll deal with it. Then there's a channel. This is supposed to be a personalized thing for you, okay? So this is supposed to be your thing, but everyone's looks the same, basically. There's no customization whatsoever. So basically, here's the evolution of the channels. I, oh my god, they, they had it down, Pat. They had a great design, okay? channel, the 1.0, the original channels, um, they had a great, great thing going on for them, um, you know, you had a video, you had a giant left wall of text, like, that's where you could write all your stuff at, um, that was kind of like your about section and stuff, and, like, date joined, views, channel views, just, like, awesome things. Your right side, basically, on the top, you'd have something you wanted to say, like, tacos, like, with tons of exclamation marks per se um, and then you'd have like tabs so like your main tab your videos playlists um, 
like subscribers, subscriptions, comments, like channel comments, and about, um, so, or no, there was no about back then. It was just on the left side of your uh, page. And then you have a video, you'd have all of those other things down there. And it was pretty nice. Then there's the 2.0 beta. I really regret hating on these channels when they first came out. Now looking back, well at the time it was bad, but now looking back it was way better. So you had like this little arrow design going on. Oh, and you could actually change all the colors and if you were a partner you had a banner. Anyways. So you could change colors. Oh, and you could have your own background, so that was pretty nice. Um, so, you know, you had all that going on for you, and then, um, well then there was, um, like I said, you had that little tab on the top that you had tacos, and then you can, you know, you had, uh, like, the top part, you have a video, then, like, you'd have videos or playlists right there, and then, you know, um, so, you know, videos or playlists, whatever. Um, and then, underneath, the left side was your wall, then, of the, everything down there, you got, like, you customize it, so it'll be, like, so, like, mine was, so, uh, friends, yeah, friends, I forgot about friends, oh, yeah, they used to have friends, um, instead of contacts, or subscribe, like, instead of the Google Plus crap, yeah, there used to actually be friends on YouTube, so they had friends, subscribers, subscriptions, um, Groups, channel comments, it was awesome. I miss it. <laughs> it was way better, so, yeah. Uh, they, they had so much better stuff back then. Like, I don't know how the newer stuff is better, but, you know, this, all this stuff was, it was awesome. And, you know, it, it, there was just a lot of better stuff about it. And then there's, so anyways, um, these channels, the original channel went through 2009, like May, t no, June 2009 is when they started to change things over. They did terrible, actually it took forever to change them over, but that's just like if you made a new account, that's when it would like change. So, then from uh, June 2010 to March 2012, there were the 2.0. Then we had the 3.0 channels. This is where things start to take a bad turn. You know how I was saying all the, like this, they were just gray and black. You could have your own background in them. And like banner if you were partnered and stuff, you know. Um, then you have your video. It was like a great. It was like a dull version of the regular ones. Um, that's what it reminded me of. Then you had like it, I don't remember much about the 3.0 Cosmic Panda design, but it just it honestly it just looked like a more dull color wise and like just how it all worked wise like a doll version of everything and there are actually only four designs you could pick so like different designs you couldn't customize then now we are stuck with the channel the, the YouTube one channel there's white pages you can have a banner for anyone no more backgrounds no more colorful stuff no more it just everyone has the same design and it sucks I cannot stand this it's terrible why why can't we have options? Here, here. YouTube. Here's my here's my advice to you. Okay? Make a test run. Yeah, a test run, okay? So basically what you should do is make like you know the test tube? They should add an option on that to see. Like or just add it as a feature temporarily saying if people like it. To customize your channel um differently. So like you could pick whichever design you want. I can guarantee you that at least 80 some percent would switch to the 1 or 0 .0 or 2.0 channels. I can guarantee it. So many people miss those. Um, I don't really think there's many people out there who prefer the 3.0 or the YouTube 1 channel opposed to the original 2. The original 2 were so much better. Like, each design, guys, just keeps getting worse and worse. If they make a 5 channel, it's gonna be terrifying. Unless they actually do good, but <laughs> there is so much doubt for that. So, if they ever make it better, that'd be great. But I, I, I highly, highly doubt that. Judging how it's been going, I don't think there's a way. Even one of the three co-founders of the site, when they after they sold to Google, I think it was like 2014, he commented saying, "What happened to my site?" 
No, that's for Google Plus. So he he doesn't even like all this. When the own creator of the site doesn't like it, how how do you like what what? That doesn't even make sense. So YouTube. Fix your site. Fix it. You need to fix it. Because here's the problem. No one likes to look. It's YouTube's ugly. <laughs> it looks like garbage. Alright? It looks like just trash. It's terrifying. No one likes it. It's too bright. We need to be able to change things around. Have color. Colors, yeah. YouTube, have you ever heard of a color? I don't... I think the only colors I know are... Let's see, uh, blue for the, some of the text. Uh, um, white. Oh, yeah, they definitely know about white. Uh, black. Okay, they know black. Um, gray. Yeah, they know gray. And then red. Because YouTube kind of is red. You know, another thing is the subscribe button. Remember when the subscribe button used to be, like, yellow? They changed it to, like, what, like, red? Now, what? I don't even know what it is now. I think it's, like, gray. Or maybe they change it. No, it used to be gray. Now it's red, I think. Remember when the subscribe used to be yellow, though? Like, the actual good old subscribe button? And remember, like, when you didn't have a picture, like, a channel picture yet, you'd have that old guy who had, like, a camera? Instead of whatever the hell there is now, I mean, now it just looks, like, stupid. <laughs> and, ah, uh, man, I remember all this stuff. Man, back, back in, like, 2009-10, those, those were, like, the last good days of YouTube. 2011 sort of sucked, then 2012 was just god awful. So, yeah. Um, oh, and by the way, the 3.0 channel lasted until June 2014, and now, ever since then, we've had the worst channel design ever. The YouTube One channel. Now, some people say it looks better than the 3.0. I yeah, whatever. I could kind of see it, but they both look awful. Like. Just look at, you gotta look at my, like, if you were to ever see my old channel, like, my two, when I had the 2.0, it, it just blows 3.0 and 4.0 out of the water, like, or YouTube 1 channel now, not 4.0, whatever, I don't care. It's, ah, oh man. They're just so bad. I didn't know they could be so bad. Someone please tell me, how are they that bad? I don't get it. How did YouTube messed up so badly? Or Google, I should say. Man, everything went fine till 2010. Everything was fine. And then they messed it up in 2011. And then 2012, everything just died. God damn it, YouTube, you fucked up. You really messed up bad. Oh, man. Fix it. That's all I'm gonna say is fix it. Because no, no one likes this new stuff. No one's liked it for years. I personally haven't liked YouTube in years. Like, well, I've liked it, you know what I mean, like, the look of it. I haven't really l enjoyed the look of YouTube since 2010? 2011, I thought it was terrible, because, I mean, we were so used to having the good layouts, supposed to, like... Now 2011 looks better, but still. And then the channels, you guys messed up in 2012. So anyway, guys, I think that's really all I need to cover. So, uh, yeah. Uh... Comment, thumbs up, subscribe. Thanks for watching, and bye bye.